Eldershield. Eldershield is an affordable, severe disability insurance scheme which provides basic financial protection to those who need long-term care, especially during old age. It is offered to eligible Singaporeans and Singapore permanent residents who are CPF members when they turn 40 years old. It provides a monthly cash payout should a member be unable to perform at least three out of six of the following daily activities washing, dressing, feeding, toileting, mobility, and transferring. If you become disabled, you are eligible for monthly insurance payments of either $300 for a maximum of 60 months or, or $400 for a maximum of 72 months and will not need to continue paying premiums. Premiums can be paid using Medisafe up to the annual Medisafe withdrawal limit. A CPF member can also use his Medisafe to pay Elder Shield premiums for parents, spouse, grandparents, and children. Elder Shield premiums are based on your age of entry, payable annually until age 65, subject to insurer's review. They do not increase with age. It provides coverage for life. You can opt to purchase a supplementary plan if you want to receive higher monthly payouts or extend the duration of the payouts. Dependents Protection Scheme The Dependents Protection Scheme is life insurance. It provides insured members and their families with some money to get through the first few years should the insured member become permanently incapacitated such that he or she can no longer work or passes away. DPS covers CPF members for a maximum sum assured of $46,000. The coverage is worldwide. It is an affordable and optional term insurance that ends at age 60. Premium is deducted yearly from the ordinary account. It, it can be deducted from the special account if there are insufficient funds in the ordinary account. The scheme is extended to CPF members who are Singapore citizens or Singapore permanent residents aged 16 to 60 years old when they make their first CPF contribution. The annual premiums are shown here. The Community Health Assist Scheme or CHAS enables Singapore citizens from lower and middle income households to receive subsidies for medical and dental care at participating general practitioners and dental clinics near their homes. Those who qualify will receive an individual blue health assist card when per capita household monthly income is $1,100 and below or annual value of residential property is less than $13,000 if the household has no income. An orange health assist card will be issued when per capita household monthly income is $1,101 to $1,800 or annual value of residential property is $13,001 to $21,000 if the household has no income. For those who qualify for the Pioneer Generation Package, chronic conditions are subsidized up to $540 a year. Common Illness receives $28.50 subsidy per visit and dental subsidies are up to $266.50 per procedure. Your employment benefits may include group health insurance coverage. Find out whether you have such a benefit and if so, what you are covered for. Group insurance policies may not cover you when you switch jobs or retire, so you should consider having a personal health policy as well. Do not wait until you are no longer working 
to buy a health insurance policy as you may no longer be insurable due to age or poor health.